Good morning, Mere Nanye Munye Bacho. Today we have assembled here for a national festival, and that is Republic Day. So now, pre today, preschool and pre primary rows will present before you a small assembly on Republic Day. So let's enjoy it. And I hand over the mark to Sehaj Kaur. Good morning, everyone. Today, we the student of preschool and pre primary rows welcome you all to Republic Day celebration. Before we start, let's take the blessing from God by doing the prayer. I request all of you to join your hands for the prayer.
I quit all of you to stand in the honor of our national flag. Also grateful to to our ancestors for this freedom. Let's listen this from our friend Abir Tomer.
Now, let's go to Gangai Sri. Indian people done with the British rule. So they decided in 1929 to remove full independence from the British on 26 January 1930. India got full independence on 15 August 1947. And the constitution was adopted on 26 January. Jai Hind. Thank a lot for this interesting information of our ancestors and the process of constitution making. Now let's see the sizzling performance of a friend from preschool Ross. Organization ISRO is all set to launch its first human mission called Gaganyan Program in 2022. The COVID-19 pandemic, continuing through 2021, caused a setback for many industries, and the same was true for the Indian Space Research Organization, but still they managed to commence missions 
Here are a few. PSLV C-51 Amazonia 1 was successfully launched in February 21 from Satish Dhawan Space Center in Shriharikota. Indian Student Satellite Unity Sat and Satish Dhawan Sat were successfully launched. GSLV F-10 renamed to EOS-3 was launched in August 21. Although it was a fit mission, but listen to what our friends have to say about this. has been allotted for Indian Railways. The plan to build 83,677 kilometers of roads is underway and will complete by 2021-22. The Bharat Mala Pariyodhana program plans to develop roads with the help of National Highway Authority of India and the Ministry of Road Transport and Highways. The Sagar Mada program, on the other hand, focuses on connectivity by sea. I'm a proud Indian. Now, Arabi will share some information about renewable energy. Globally, India is number fifth for overall installed renewable energy capacity, fourth for wind power and fifth for solar power. 
As of 2018, Solar and Energy projects capable of producing 22 gigawatts has been installed in the country. The government of India has set a target to promote renewable energy capacity. This includes wind power, solar power, biomass power, and small hydro power. Thank you. Let's hear about the development and other uh, education from our friend uh, Zoe. The government of India has taken several steps in the field of education. Introduction of NEP 2020 Including opening of IITs and IIMs in new location. Furthermore, many education organizations are using online mode of education. The coming years, the higher education in India is set for major changes and development. India emerges as the single largest provider of global. Talent with one in four graduates of the world being a product of Indian higher education system. These are only some sectors we have been able to name. Other sectors like tourism industries, food processing, are reaching new pinnacle with every passing year. The brain we see is possible to achieve only because you want to know. Now it is time to see the dance performance by the students of pre-primary doors. <laughs> अलबेलों का मस्तानों का इस देश का यारों इस देश का यारों क्या कहना ये देश है दुनिया का कहना Ruchi ma'am, you are not audible. Ruchi ma'am, you are not audible. You are muted. Yeah. 
Unmute yourself, Ruchi. Uh, am I audible now? Yes. Yeah. Thank you so much. And uh, we all are proud, all of you, all the participants. Now I request our honorable director, sir, to share his valuable thoughts and bless each one of us with his uh, thoughts. Thank you so much. And I request our director, sir. Sir, please. Thank you, Ruchi. Uh... Dear Neetu, team of Indraprastha teachers, my grandparents and parents who are equal partner in the process of educating our young children and my dear little children. Wish you all very happy Republic Day celebration. It is our national festival. I'm so happy to see your enthusiasm. I'm so happy to see your participation. And believe it, this is the patriotism. When you participate in every national event, that means you become patriotic. My dear children, I'm not talking about the history, about the constitution. You are too young to understand. But I only say three things. Number one, there is a holy book of our country, which is called constitution. And it gives us rules and regulation. Your teachers, guide you, inform you, your parents guide you and inform you about these rules and regulations. Aapko sirf itna karna hai, jo aapke parents, grandparents or teachers abhi rules batate hai, aapne unko follow karna hai aur wahi sab se bada patriotism hai. Dusra, har admi desh ke liye kuch na kuch contribute karta hai. Our soldiers fight at border. Our do doctors work in hospital. Our farmers work in the fields for our food and everybody. Police wala, support staff, everybody works. And they all work for the development of nation. Aapko bhi work karna hai. Aur aapka kya kaam hai abhi? Aapka kaam achche se padhna hai. Achche achche baaton ko sikhna hai. Un baaton ko sikhte huye. Achche se padhte huye. Apne shariir ka pura khayal rakhte huye. Aapko aise bade admi banna hai. जिसके ऊपर पूरे देश को, आपके पेरेंट्स, ग्रैंडपेरेंट्स को और आपके टीचर्स को बहुत गर्व हो। Everybody should feel pride on each one of you। तीसरा, इस पढ़ते हुए की पढ़ने की जर्नी में कुछ बातें आपको अच्छी लगेंगी। कुछ बातें अच्छी नहीं लगेगी। आपने अपने टीचर्स से, अपने पेरेंट्स से हर बात शेयर करते हुए पूछना है, जो बात आपके फ्यूचर के लिए है, वो अच्छी लगे या बुरी लगे आपको माननी है, और कुछ बातें जो आपके कंफर्ट के लिए हैं, प्ले के लिए हैं, अगर वो बुरी लगे तो उनको एक्सेप्ट करना है। मेरे बच्चों, you are the best children on this earth. I know you are being guided by the best of the team, both at home and in the school. My only humble and humble suggestion, request, inspiration, whatever you take it, to you all, be the good citizen of this country, be proud of your nation, the motherland, 
India. Is that okay? This is the only uh, only factor which will make you patriotic for this country. आप सब देशभक्त कहलाओगे एक बार फिर से आप सबको रिपब्लिक डे गणतंत्र दिवस की बहुत बहुत बधाई जय हिंद जय हिंद जय हिंद थैंक यू वेरी मच thank you so much sir for your kind words our students are the best i am always I... with my children yes sir thank you so much now i request our montessori head ms neetu sethi to render the vote of thanks neetu ma'am thank you ruchi ma'am and thank you sir good morning to honorable director sir all the heads of the school grandparents parents and my dear students It's my privilege to propose a vote of thanks on this occasion on behalf of Indraprastha International School Dwarka. I'm truly honored to extend sincere thanks to our respected director sir Dr. Rajesh Hasija for his presence, motivation, all the words of wisdom that have radiated a source of energy within all of us. You are truly the driving force for all of us sir. Thank you sir for your presence. A big thanks to Vice Principal Ma'am Miss Shalini Jain for her unstinted support and able guidance. Thank you, Ma'am. My sincere thanks to all the heads of the school, grandparents, parents for your presence today. Your presence motivated all of us. I extend my love and thanks to all our little champs who have put in tremendous hours of efforts and practice to put up this wonderful and inspiring show in front of us. exhibiting an abundance of talent as sir said you have to be true and honest citizen and that must be the biggest salute to our country so happy republic day to all of you jai hind jai hind jai hind Thank you so much everyone bye bye everyone love you all bye bye, bye.